This is a map that shows every state that's reported the kissing bug, and it is up to date as of April 2023. Now, once again, I do have to throw in another caveat. This is a state that has reported at least one or two kissing bugs, so not every state here is created equally. For instance, if Illinois has reported one to two kissing bugs, they're lit up. And they're lit up the same color as a state like Texas, where kissing bugs are pretty established. The states that should definitely be on the lookout, though, is anything that sits along the southern border, so Texas, New Mexico, Southern California, and Florida. Now, if we want to talk about Chagas specifically, it's estimated that one in two kissing bugs will carry Trypanosoma cruzii, that's including the United States, so that's 50%. This figure comes from Texas A&M and some of their research on kissing bugs, but here you can see the cases of Chagas disease specifically in Texas based on county, and they're all centered primarily around the Gulf. And of course, you know, another caveat, because I'm doing that a lot this video, this figure is generated from the period of 2013 to 2016, so things change. The CDC estimates that right now about 300,000 people in the United States have Chagas, which is probably an undercount considering that it's kind of a cryptic disease. 